When I see a play like that, I come back to risk reward. I don't know about you, but is it worth it at that point, whatever you're going to pick up, to either take the hit, and in this case, lose the football. Well, it should have gone down. I mean, hindsight's always 20-20, but that's the safe play. You're exactly right. Hindsight's really never wrong, is it? Because you can analyze it, but I think ultimately you got to look at it as a first option, taking care of the ball, getting what you can, and that's it. Don't worry about it anymore. They'll stay on the ground. Balazs again. And past the 35, he'll be dropped a yard or two shy of the 30. Give him 12 yards there, and the Dolphins have a first down. They're trying to show that they can run the ball, protect this lead, give it to the backs, play a little bit of keep away, don't you think? And that's probably a good philosophy at this point, going to make that defense stand up and stop them. And he lost the football, and the Cardinals have got it. Going the other way, and his guys will take over at the 30-yard line. So the defense there, opportunistic. It's nice to give them credit, isn't it? Because so many times it's more a matter of what the offensive guy didn't do. He didn't secure the ball, didn't cover up. In this case, let's just give credit to where it belongs. Yes, baby, that's on. Ready? 70, Indy. Just like that, just like that. Five. Off play action, Vaughn. This is caught. And they are able to stop him, but he does take it all the way to the two. A really nice gain of 25 yards. Looking to throw. Vaughn. And this is caught by Parker for a Miami touchdown. Devontae Parker, his second touchdown of the game, giving him 12 on the season. And the Dolphins use the short field to their advantage as they cash in for six. Sanders now to add the extra point. It's good to make it 17-7. They had the short field, and they made quick work of it. Just two plays to get into the end zone. Now after the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Sanders. And that'll carry over the back line of the end zone for a touchback. Ready to go with their next drive, and at the line, the Cardinal offense. And the turnover last time, that's sort of been symptomatic of their struggles here in this one. Big word. I like it, though, yeah. because you're exactly you right. Like that, don't you? All game long, they've struggled moving the ball, turning it over on the last possession. Is that word again, symptomatic? Yeah. yeah. I like that. Your analysis, symptomatic of the success of this broadcast. What I like is that you gave me the word, and I just kept using it. <laughs> and they're going to get him behind the line yet again as his nightmare afternoon continues. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. Back now in Miami. It's Cardinal football, but they trail here as we get set to bring you the fourth and final quarter. Murray now on first down. And an alley to run. And they've got it well across midfield, down to the 40 before it's all said and done. Now after the completion, we're going to get a timeout, an injured player. We'll get an update when we come back to Miami. So now first and 10 as they've crossed into Miami territory right at the 40. But now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. So second down and 10. Once again, they'll go from the 40. Murray again, second and 10. Got his man. It's Williams. Brandon, they didn't get everything they wanted out of that play but the tight end did, <laughs> and I don't mean it in a positive way. Great job of him holding on after absorbing that big hit. Here's Murray as he sets to throw it. Under pressure, and he will go down. Sack back at the 38. Kyler Fackrell in there to drop him for a six-yard loss, and that will lead to fourth down. Brandon, I think you understand the type of afternoon this offensive line is having. It is a long one for them. Long for you to spend it with me. Long for them trying to block those guys. They've given up a whole lot of sacks, and the speed and quickness that defensive line is eating them alive. They've got good starting field position as they come up here 